I had the craziest urge to stick my finger in your ear right now. You wouldn't like what came out on your finger. Yeah. We're gonna get ready. That what? We're getting ready. We're getting ready. We're getting ready to go to through two events today. First up, we're going to Naked Sundays, which is at the, I'm pretty sure it's a skincare brand that's gifted me some things before, but I'm not sure I've tried anything yet. And then Solo Wave, I guess they're like, I don't know if it's a partnership or how it works, but I've never been to a gifting suite for skincare. It's always been, it's always clothes, typically. I don't even think I've been to one for makeup. It's typically just clothes. You go there, you get the clothes, people try stuff on, and then you go home with whatever you picked. You can pick like a few things. Usually it's like six or seven, and then you can take it home. But I've never been to one for skincare, so I wonder if they're just gonna like give us skincare. Probably like, I'm assuming maybe some sort of introduction to the product, something telling us about the product a bit. Damn, this smells good. And then I want to say maybe that's what it'll be, and then they gift it to us. But then after we're going to an intimate event with milk makeup. I don't even know what it is. I don't know if it's a dinner. I don't know what it is, but um, I'm gonna be there and it sounds like it's gonna be cute. They're gonna send a car to pick us up, guys. We're gonna live our bougiest life today. My mustache. Lasering tomorrow. I'm so excited. And I do my makeup different. Damn it, I'm becoming like a natural girly. Like I'm starting to like it. Oh, fuck. Right in the era when I wanted to start putting that shit on, I start being like, oh wait, that's a little cute. You don't even understand, I set this shit out of my face when I have to keep makeup on. Because my makeup is, my face is not a face that can hold makeup all day without some support. Like, girl, the makeup will literally slide off my face. Like, it will slide off. Okay, outfit-wise, um, we're looking kind of a mess, and it's because I did not pre-plan what I was wearing, so we're kind of just wearing whatever the hell I grabbed first, which is this shirt that I got on top out, and then this skirt that I, I'm pretty sure it's from Cider. We're just gonna try to make this look like I meant to wear this and that it looks cute. The skirt was really long though, so I literally pinned it. Cause I feel like when it's mad long, it looks kind of crazy. So I feel like if we get like as high up as we can, that's gonna look, oh. And that makes sense why it's not fitting because I literally tucked the shorts underneath up into my things. One second. We gotta take this hair out because, ooh girl. Ooh, I'm through, ooh. I'm through. This wig is so pretty. I just didn't take it out of the braids since the day Joni put it in and um, I didn't touch it from that day till today. So um, this is the most air she's breathed. So she's a little tingly. She's feeling a little shy. And also, you know who might be shy? My new kitten that's I'm meeting Friday. I mean, Saturday. <laughs> uh, I didn't vlog anything because I don't know. So yeah. I can't um, see this. When you do it the angle like that, I think we get lazy eyes, but... <laughs> Joni won't let me have any more for matcha. Oh, just because I drink her first one, the whole thing, and then I just finished mine, and now I can't have hers. Um, right, because if she has any more caffeine, she's literally gonna have a heart attack, please. What, and I bet you want it so bad you can Oh, that them. was evil! That was wicked! What did you just say? Nothing. We're at the car place picking up my car and there's a fly haunting us and I need lip gloss. She has the good lip gloss. Well, I have a good lip gloss too, but hers has a, like the color of hers is prettier. I have this one from Milk, but I like to put this on top of everything. Oh, and there's matcha in my purse, so. Ooh. Show them my hair whiskers. Ooh, I'm a cat. so cute and pretty I'm a and cat cute then. and pretty. Oh, I'm a cat. And then she has a Blasian cat. Um, no. Her cat's not Blasian, but I think she's oh, Blasian. Also, um, look at how Shallon is driving, literally with two fingers. It's really hot. Because we just got um, our car back. Don't look at the background. Yay. You you can't see because you are not allowed to know where we are. It's literally boiling hot. Can I come in here, guys, please? Hey! Anybody want to let a girl in? No? <laughs> okay, we're on our way to Malibu now. And Lord have mercy, y'all, I lost my wallet. <laughs> I've never lost my wallet. In my 26 years of life, I've been irresponsible many times, but not irresponsible enough to lose my wallet. So I'm very ashamed of myself and I'm very upset. I thought I threw it in the trash. We literally had to get the property manager to come and help us. And I'm not even kidding. We're literally taking brooms and searching around in the trash. It's not in the trash. And I'm like, okay, maybe it's in Joni's purse. Cause when we leave and I don't bring a purse, Joni puts my keys and my wallet in her purse. It's not in her purse. Where the, where else would it be? I don't know. I'm trying to wait 
until I get home today and really look around my apartment because if it's not there, I need to cancel them cards because I have my ID in there, my cards. I have like 80 bucks in there. That's a lot of money for me to have on me, man. I'll never have cash on me. Like, I don't deserve this. This is so scary. Okay, what I will say is if it's not in the dumpster, then I feel like it has to be somewhere in my house or the lift that we took to go to the grocery store because after I crashed my car, whoops, I had to get it repaired and we picked up my car later, but we were Ubering around before we picked up my car and I messaged the lift driver and I asked him if he's seen my car. Oh, wait, I think he replied. Let's see. Oh, pray he has it. Driver did not find the item. No, but if he's just keeping it for silly. It's not a real place. Like, what if it's so casual? This looks just like the GTA map. Guys, we just got here. This was the most insane. I don't know what I expected, but it most certainly wasn't this. Not at all. It looks like, you know when you look out of a plane and it looks like you're in the clouds? It looks like we're in the clouds. Um, I ate all my lip gloss off, so we're getting a little touch up. This is the Odyssey lip gloss. It's the one I have in my purse. Like what? Every time I see my queen, like are you joking me? Like are you joking me? The way the sun is hitting, like don't. Hello, be in the look at my shadow. Oh yes, my queen. Let me take. Wait, she got the good camera, y'all, and my camera's on one percent. No, but I have that. This one. This is my favorite camera. zv one F. I love it. I just got the E10 too, and I really like it. But I don't know. I don't. I don't know the settings I like yet. Yeah, no, I like this. Hi, Buki. This is crazy. Like, what the hecky? <laughs> this is crazy. Like, what? Are you joking? Sometimes I get the craziest imposter syndrome and stuff like this, and I'm like, damn, am I supposed to be here? Like, I don't know if I'm supposed to be here, but. I, I feel like I am supposed to be here, and it's cool, and I've been making plans, and I've been talking to people. Laser away appointment number two. We're going to get the legs today because somebody that was late, it was me, um, didn't make it to my appointment in time, so they couldn't do my legs yesterday. Oh, oh, no copyright. They're gonna do my, oh, you can't even see, my upper lip and my chin because it's given um, full grown beard, and I don't like that. Oh my gosh, my hands are so dry. Literally like peeling. That looks crazy. I don't know if you can see it, but my hands are like literally peeling. 99% rubbing alcohol will do that to you. It will. Yeah, this looks crazy. Okay, but we gotta go. Okay, guys, we're back. We're doing the lip, the chin, the happy trail, and the legs. I'm scared of the legs. Hey, we just did my upper lip and my chin, and it didn't hurt at all. The only thing was I can't hold my breath for longer than like one second, so you have to hold your breath, and I was like... <laughs> Mind you, it was literally one second. It was literally one second. We did the front of my legs already. Now we're doing the back. Oh, that tickles. <laughs> um, and it honestly wasn't bad at all. It just stings a bit around the knees. That's about it though. It doesn't hurt. There was really no pain on the legs at all. So far, I fear Coochie is still in first place for most painful. Okay, we're all done. I'm just putting my aloe on. They give me aloe in cortis. I think she said cortisone. I don't know if that's really what it was. I don't remember the name. <laughs> And I'm putting that on, there's just the chalk lines on my legs still, but when I go home, I'm gonna shower anyway, so I don't mind it. Wasn't too bad, I'm not gonna hold you. Okay guys, I know I didn't film the process, but we're going to the Transformers movie premiere. This is the dress, it's from ASOS. Look at my ass, like, who not thick? Trey's on his way to come get me right now, and we're about to leave. I smell so good. I'm wearing Rose by Kay Ali, and I'm so excited to take y'all and actually remember. Like, I actually have space in my purse to take y'all. You just pull it up. Oh, they got In-N-Out? Pull it up to the same, be the be the be. I've been having so much In-N-Out recently. Like, right. cause there's one super close to like where I live. And like, I've, why? It's so good, <laughs> like, yeah. In-N-Out's so freaking good. Like, it's so freaking, I've literally they paying you like, to say that? No, actually. Mm, mm, like, it's been mm. so, I've literally been going like. Don't trust influencers, y'all. Like, four times Don't a week. It's like crazy. Like, whenever I'm like, oh, I want something to eat for He's freaking, oh, I almost said a bad word. Um, oh, the Gucci light babe. is crazy. It's that sunset. <laughs> Optimus Prime. <laughs> Period. Lady <laughs> Fabulous. Thank you. Okay, you know what I slay? You do slay. I'm not enough like the way you look.
Trey just demolished me in that game and just pissed me off. He got the margarita pizza. He copied Nia the last time she was here. And she's gonna see this so she knows you're a copycat. Copy the cat he did. I got the lamb cavatelli. Guess what the f just happened to us? <laughs> We're sitting here enjoying our dinner. And then there's um there's a really nice lady next to me and she's like staring at the table like this. And I'm like <laughs> There's a roach on the table. <laughs> Y'all, there's a roach on the table. Trey and I immediately lost our appetites and now we have to go home. <laughs> I hate bugs. I hate bugs. And I think on that list, it goes like this. Ro no, drain flies, roaches, ants. No, wait. Drain flies, roaches, ants, spiders. Y'all, the roach on the table and the lady comes up and she's like, your waiter told us what happened. We're going to comp your meal. Trey goes, oh no, I literally said. <laughs> Huh? I feel like it would have been different if it was like an ant. Like I feel like you tend to have like an ant on a table sometimes. Like a tiny little cute little dainty bitch. That was a fucking cockroach. <laughs> they should have shut that shit down. Like, like what the hell? Do y'all understand that's my favorite restaurant in LA, <laughs> bruh? And I'm never stepping foot in that bitch again. I'm never going back, Trey. Oh my gosh, wow. Trey, we need mm. to find a new, we need to go to Acapulco. Acapulco, yeah, we'll go to Acapulco. We need to go to Acapulco and watch, you're gonna love it. I saw, I'm do like, you understand the girl, the girl next to us was literally, all I saw was I looked up and I saw this. <laughs> and I'm dead ass, like I'm not, She, her eyes were huge. And then I look at the guy and he's also like, oh. And I'm no. literally, Trey, immediately I went, <laughs> I, I literally go, what, <laughs> what is it? <laughs> And then she just goes, I don't know, we should tell you. I said, what is that? <laughs> and then I look and I see that bitch crawling up the table. I literally like, uh, Trey, I literally went, uh, like, oh I like couldn't gosh. even open my mouth to tell you there was a bug. Like I just like, freaked out. It like actually just hit me what happened. <laughs> like, like it actually just hit me. Mind you, our favorite restaurant out here. <laughs> our favorite one. Did we deserve that? No, no not at all. Well, um, dark day. I was gonna pay. Yeah. Wait, I was gonna pay. Yeah. Wait. She said, I'm gonna take the house, we'll take care of it. And you said, no. <laughs> I was gonna right. pay. Right. Wait. Deranged. Wait, I was gonna pay right. for the cockroach. You and were gonna pay for the cockroach's dinner that's gonna <laughs> eat those pizza crusts that you left on the table. Right. This is on their way. My cat. They're five minutes away. And I'm so excited to wait. My, my cat is dying. I'm on. I think that's them. I'm so gagged just because, wow, like I really came a long way. Being terrified of animals and now, now we're here. Oh my gosh, it is them. Why am I about to cry? It's literally just a cat. Why am I on the verge of tears? This is actually so unserious. I'm just so excited to meet her. She's here, but she's kind of just looking around still because her foster's just left. So I think she's still, <laughs> she's still discovering where she is. Hi, baby. Oh, she's probably gonna hide around for a while. Hi, baby. She's over here, but she's, she's still exploring. Baby, Wanna play? Good girl. She's really just walking around, figuring out where the hell she's at. Wait, 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 wait. Here. Oh my gosh, you're greedy. That's enough, only a little more. Okay, that's it, that's it, you're done. Bruh. do not wanna go to bed. She think it's playtime, playtime, playtime. I played with you for six hours today. Every time I put her in her bed, she literally gets right back up. Sister, you were just sleeping. You only got up because I moved. Kitty, kitty girl. Oh, kitty. oh my gosh, <laughs> you're being crazy. Go to sleep. You were literally just knocked out. You know you'd be out of breath. She got to do the leap of faith. Look, look, look. Hey, you still not gonna get, damn it. <laughs> that is not food. Back when she feels me walk away, she wakes up. You can sleep, baby. Oh, we love shopping. 
Circles as well. Like come on forward, left side, fire. Push it down away from you. Firm on your body, squeeze it. After the event, they were giving us these energy drinks, and I accidentally told me I was drinking an energy drink, and I forgot she was gonna get mad, and then she said I have to stop drinking it, but she's not here to stop me. It's not even good. That's the craziest part. Like, this kind of tastes like shit. Um, but now I'm spiting her, so now I have to finish it. Today is, I don't know, because I never know the day of the week, or the date of the week or the bait of the week, or the sate of the week, or the the, 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 the the ache of the week. The ache of the week, what do that even mean? It mean my tummy hurt it. Like what? Like shut up. I need to play some GTA. I haven't played GTA in how long? I have no idea, it's been a fat minute. Today we don't have much on the docket besides filming. Filming right now, I'm doing this face chart. Y'all will get to see it early. It's this face chart, and it's only half a face because the other half was like another season or something, and no. You guys remember the power of makeup, makeup trend? What did that trend like mean to you? Because I didn't, un I don't know if it spoke to me the way that it seemed to speak to a lot of other people. From what I think it was supposed to speak to us, it was like, the power of makeup is so great. And I think to me, I was like, okay, <laughs> what does that mean? Not even on some like, I'm different, I don't get it. I literally just didn't get it. I was thinking about doing it the other day, but then I was like, you should not be doing a trend girl that you didn't even understand at the time of it trending. But what did that like mean to y'all? Also, I know I didn't post last week's vlog on time. Sad news, I had to give my cat back and I've been really sad about it. So I've just been like moping around. She helped me a lot with my depression and with some other stuff and while that was great, I could tell that she wasn't that happy because she was a kitten and they told me that they thought she would be fine by herself because she was so like independent, but being independent doesn't mean she won't feel lonely. And I played with her all the time. Like I played with her all day long. I was always out there with her. That was actually another reason that I couldn't keep her. I couldn't like take care of myself. I kind of only took care of her. She became like first priority very quickly. And at the same time, I did not know how to like care for myself while also caring for my cat. So I wasn't eating. I didn't have time to work. I, didn't, I couldn't do anything. She was also really clingy So she always wanted to like be near me so she wouldn't use her litter unless I was like in her vicinity She wouldn't eat her food unless I was in her vicinity. She wouldn't go to sleep unless I was in her vicinity She always wanted me to be there and that wasn't a problem for me if I could like get other stuff done So like parts like that I could have seen her doing so much better with if I had another kitten But I literally didn't adopt another one because I, I was like, okay I don't know if I have the bandwidth for two cats and they said she's like gonna be fine. So like Okay, I, they know her better than I do. She needed to know the cat so quickly. Like, she got tired of playing by herself and playing with me after like day two. And around like day th three or four, I'm noticing like she's sleeping all the time and she doesn't play unless I play with her. And even then she would get bored so fast. And it would be toys that she really liked to play with. Like, I was like, damn, are you like depressed already? Like, oh, gee. I think what I learned is no kittens unless you have another kitten, um, which I think I would do again. Um, but I'm like in my dramatic era where I'm like, I don't want anyone but my cat. So if she's still available when I'm out of where I live now, which is the plan, and I have space to give the cats like their own room, then I will hopefully if she's still there, adopt her again because I really miss my cat. I've literally just cried and cried and cried because it would have been selfish, I feel like, to keep her knowing that she clearly needed another cat around or else she was going to become very depressed and have single kitten syndrome. And I didn't want that to happen to her because I really loved her. So I just gave her back as soon as I started seeing the signs because she was also getting attached to me very quickly and... I didn't want her to be super attached and then it would be really hard for her to leave, so. But it was not fun, it wasn't easy and I just, um, I still cry. Every time I talk to her, uh, talk about her for too long, I start crying. Oh, oh, help. But anyway, I know it was best for her to leave, especially because before I adopted her, I went to go see her and she has so many other cats to play with there. I think coming from having so many other cats to play with constantly to me and it just being her and I, and she only met me once before it, and then there's no other cats. Mm -mm. And I wanted to introduce her to- Oh, it's a tire! Joni and I wanted to introduce her to my cat, but we did it through a door, but I think it was just too soon and my cat was like not with it. Her cat was actually surprisingly really receptive and mine was not. She did not want to meet a new cat. She was um, kind of pissed actually. So that didn't work. And hopefully if someone else adopts her, they have another cat for her and she's happier there. I'm leaving, I'm gonna cry. Okay, we're doing this like faded- Oh, I'll put the face chart here. Ricky, you have the damn face chart because I got it from you. And I'm sort of trying to perfect this smoky eye. 
I'm gonna fight for my life with a smoky eye every time, y'all. It's just not for me. I love how they look. I just don't understand the um mathematics behind it. I also think I'm way too heavy-handed for a smoky eye. Like that's not that's not smoke, dear. That's a fire. That was funny. I kind of hate that. Don't ask me any questions about my face. It's it's still coming together. I literally came on here to show you like how different eyebrows really impact your face. Like wow, I used to do my eyebrows super thick and crazy in high school and middle school. Honestly, any year in school, I didn't know what the hell I was doing until I graduated. I need to find old pictures of my makeup because I need to replicate that shit. I used to look crazy, except for when I did like makeup looks. I was really good at eyeshadow. I think that was because I was like determined. I was in the beauty community, and all of my friends in the beauty community were so good at it, and I was jealous and i was at the time my dream was to be a makeup artist so i was like girl i need to know what the, i'm doing i've literally done it all i was a nail tech oh, how am i gonna fade these out i was never good at fading them out they always looked harsh oh never mind that was actually very easy okay i just finished the look and now i'm gonna try to put in these contacts i'm scared i don't know if they even have a prescription and i'm scared it's gonna look like the last time i did this when i looked like l and not in a good way i just looked scary you know what's funny? I don't have to pull my eye down to take my contacts out anymore, but I do have to do it to put them in still. Which is weird because there was a point in time where I was able to put them in without pulling my eye. And then I don't know what happened. We're doing a Judy's ones from Pinky Paradise. I put it on one finger, and the reason I dry my eye is because I had to use the other one to like pull down, and that'll fuck up my makeup. Are they too big? Does it get scary? I can't tell until I put in the other one. Also, when you get contacts like this, you need to let them sit overnight. Like, don't put them in your eyeballs straight from that container. And don't put them in your eyeballs straight from putting them in your own container. Like, you need to, like, let them sit in solution overnight. So put that on the finger. Dry the finger. Oh, they are a prescription. I can see. Ah, uh, they're not cute, though. I look scary. Okay, it's not scary. It looks, it looks fine. I don't hate the contacts. It's growing on me a little bit. I think it looks better on camera than in real life, though. That's very strange. In real life, they look really big and scary. But when I took pictures just now, they looked cute. So leave me alone. Why did I just get to level 138 and with $2,000 left in this shit and blooms? I had 36 towers placed, 600,000 pop count, total damage. 21 million, one million dollars, a hundred and thirty thousand dollars of cash generated, twelve thousand Moabs pop, three powers used, zeros instance instas used, five hundred and thirty abilities used, and four hundred thousand dollars spent. <laughs> Don't ever think you can get cute like me. I could continue, cause I can afford it, but nah, I got shit to do. Okay, guys. I had a day where my brain decided if today was gonna be a good day or a bad day, and it decided it's gonna be a bad day. I started out really good. I started out on schedule, I did what I was supposed to. Then I was like, okay, it's time to film. Then my brain said, no, you need to caulk your kitchen. And I'm like, no, I need to film. My brain's like, no, you need to caulk your kitchen immediately or else. So I spent four hours caulk. This is not real. Like, you know what I think is happening? I think because it's been so long since I've had an Alani new, and then for me to take, to have finally have one when I haven't had it in a long time. Wow, today's gonna be rough. When I haven't had one in a long time, I think my body's like, whoa, what happened, dude? And I'm going a little crazy. But I'm really excited to open Taobao. I should record opening Taobao. Let's open the Taobao stuff. Oh, orange cat I love so much. Hi. She's just a baby. Hi, baby. Hi, orange. We're gonna leave, we're gonna go get food really quick and then we'll be right back, mm -hmm. We just picked up our food and then I saw this and I got one of each. We're gonna eat that first, then our food. Stop! Don't, actually I'm not gonna show you the place because don't come here, don't piss me off. Shaloni eats pho. Yes, queen. So we have a chicken pho. And I think that's me literally it. Me holding this like it's my fault. Hello? Look at Johnny's little bread. It's, I literally love it. This is Joni's, but it's Wagyu beef. And we Get got like her. chicken dumplings. She thought it was pork. Don't look at the logo. Me literally trying to hide it and cover, put the bowl like this. Hmm. Can we watch something? No, no, no! Put a patch on it. Put a patch on it! Fine. Here. No. Right here? Sure. 
Mind you, she just did this to me with her Alani new, but oh, when I'm scared of her and I run, it's, it's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna eat and then we'll return with a review, but not really, probably not, because um, we've had this um, already and we know it's good. It's mad. Don't tell them. They, it's we, really we, bad, we actually. I forgot that it's not good. It's really ass. We never told them the name of the place, though. Yeah, but I think they saw it on this. Ricky, blur the name. The clip coming back in my hair is in a ponytail. My strap is falling off. Help. We're gonna tell them what we're trying. We're trying, um... <gasps> Wait! <laughs> what? My hands are really dry. <laughs> <laughs> I thought there was something gross on here. <laughs> you literally said, ah! Like, you know like when your hands that are dry so and so much paper? And it feels like really disgusting? Mine are too, uh, but I don't think it bothers me as much. No, that's a sensory. I can't. Do you want lotion? Get your lotion, the one that smells good, I'll get that you too. That was crazy. We can be sensory girls together. That was together. worse than styrofoam. No way. You yes. hate styrofoam. It was so, that's why I screamed. <laughs> I feel like you still hate styrofoam so much more. But uh, When I move styrofoam slightly, you literally go... Styrofoam is more like a body thing. This one's more like a... Like um, you felt it. Like it was in my bones. <laughs> Wait, that's real because with styrofoam, you don't like how it sounds. Mm -hmm. Not like how it feels. <laughs> Look at my neck. We're gonna try these chicken dumplings. Eee. Okay. They're presentation. That looks spicy. We did leave them in a tight enclosed box, so they're probably a little soggy. You just bite it. That's true. Wait, I don't wanna bite the whole thing. Lady and trap it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna fart. I'm gonna fart. No! <laughs> okay, you bite it first. That was not no, working. We literally did it fine. <laughs> I got mine. That is good. <laughs> I like it. It's good, but I think it's kind of oily. A little bit. It is a pot sticker, but like, mm. you know when you taste like oil flavor? No, no. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we got four ice creams. We have pistachio, cookies and cream. The girl at the, at the place said the cookies and cream was the best to her. You told her not to lie. That was so funny. And I'm glad she didn't. This one um, doesn't have the name on it. I don't remember. What, oh, it's Gimme More, whatever the hell that is. And then Mango Nada. I want to try this first, please. Please. I didn't even see this on the menu. Please. Okay. okay. First up, Mango Nada. Oh, and they are incredibly mushy. Should we put them in my freezer? Yeah. Yeah. Never mind. We have Taobao box number one. You can't even see Joni because she's behind it. But she's right there. Oh my gosh, they literally just see the top of your head. Wave. <laughs> Taobao loves taping a random piece of box at the top. That's their shit, like, that's their shit. Okay, let's just take stuff out. Oh, that brand, they, this brand on Taobao makes really good basic shirts. I need to send it to you because you said you need basics, right? You said you need basics, right? Smell it. Listen to me. Ooh, a bath mat. I think. That's a hand towel. Then there's Hello Kitty pajamas. This one smells fine. Shalyn has a lot of these PJs and she always buys them from Taobao and I think they're the cutest thing ever. They look like little doll clothes. I didn't think you would want any because oh, you I said don't you don't like, like this stuff. Okay, that's what I thought. I like it for you. That's what I thought. I was like, I tried to get you something and you were like, no. I just noticed the Alana new wear off. I feel like a person again. And we're off when we were eating. That's good. Yeah. White t-shirt. This was one dollar. Ah, it's blue. Get me at the player shit. I'm acting brand new. You. Thank you, Gaga. Bitches think they run shit when they really ran. Just ran through. Why did you say just first? You <laughs> threw off the vibe. <laughs> it's so sparkly. That's a Cuban link. If anybody asked y'all, this was a rack. That is not a Cuban link. That looks nothing like a Cuban link. It's a Brazil link. Let me give y'all a close up to show you just how cool this is. Open. What the heck is that? A phone case. Wait, it it's has every Hello Kitty. Oh, and you can put your hand in it. Oh my gosh. I've never seen something like that before. As soon as I saw brown Hello Kitty, they sold me. Oh I can't gosh. wait to take pictures like this. You, you, I was literally just about to say, you should take a mirror picture because that's cute. Like, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Grab that. Put that bowl down. What? Grab this. Go in front of the camera. Oh, to show them. Stick your face behind it. Is he doing it? Look at me. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. It is pretty. I love lamps. What is this? Oh, it's my big shirts. Oh, the Betty Boops. Betty Boop as a boxer. What is it a boob? Boxer boob. Wherever this girl is from, I have so much stuff of her and I don't know where it's from. I forgot her name. Tommy? Is this the last thing? Yay. And You've been here goes... for an hour. Oh, so don't and that's the last of the Tower Bower. Now we have to go because we have a bedtime and we're already about to pass it by. 